there is something magical about being at the beach. And unfortunately, it can't be all day today. We're gonna see how many fish we can catch in about two and a half hours. And hopefully, we can go home with some dinner. I don't know what the tide is like right now. I don't know how warm the water is. I don't even know what's biting. I don't really know a lot because my name is Anthony and I suck at fishing, but we're gonna try. Yeah, I'm hoping I need to use them. I do have some lures, but I'm really not good at lures and don't like using them. So I'm gonna try to catch some bait. We'll see how it goes. Gotta be honest, not feeling super confident about catching anything today. It's a lot of seaweed. Can't see anything. Nothing. Well, nothing on the net. Yeah, I honestly don't feel good about my chances of even catching one fish. Let's see if there's any sampleys out, and maybe that'll be a little bit better. I saw that sandpiper, so there might be something. Whoa. There's some fish over there. All right, sandpiper. You onto something I'm not? Oh, there we go. A couple of fleas. That's awesome. All right, getting some bait. We're getting somewhere. There we go. Awesome. Feeling some big guys down there. There we go. There's two. All right, chances are getting better that we're gonna catch some fishies today. Yeah, I found them a lot of sand fleas right here. They're just everywhere. They're, they just keep coming out. Boom. I just said I was feeling not confident, now I'm feeling pretty confident. Cause these are some good baits. Like perfect size guys, perfect. Look at that, there's a couple baities. I literally just looked at where the sandpiper was and I was like, oh, were you onto something? Yes, he was. Awesome. Doesn't look like much. Are they ready for this? Oh, so nasty. I don't really know what's around this type of year, but I think it probably whiting would be something that might eat those. They're really good sized bait, so I'm excited. Let's catch some fish. So don't necessarily recommend using your smallest rod as your first rod, but it's the one that already has this, the hook set up that I want. Like a lot of things on this channel, I don't know if this is the right way to hook them, but a hook is through it, so count it. There we go. I keep seeing all these waves crashing. I'm just gonna cast right over that and see if I'm able to hook into something. Oh, one bait's gone. Also, all the seaweed. Now I'm actually just gonna throw this on a bigger rod, so that might be a smarter idea. All right, buddy, catch me a fish. Things are so alien looking. I haven't seen some fish jump, so I just moved my bait onto this little bit bigger rod here so it's a little bit higher up has more angle on the water and i'm gonna take my smaller rod and put a top water or some sort of lure on it i don't know what to use probably what i should use at the beach because i genuinely don't know but i've seen a couple of fish jump that are either mullet or mackerel 25 pound test for a liter i'm so bad at telling if i'm a fish or not that's not good so on the other side of this liter i gotta throw a lure and just so you know what I'm working with, this is what we got. We got this little guy, it's a head in Super Spook Junior, I think. This bone Super Spook. This other Super Spook. And the reason I have those is because they were on clearance. I have this little swim bait that I think is for bass. And then some mullet stuff. It is the mullet run, oh, that one, <laughs> well, that broke. I'm thinking this might be good because it's the mullet run-ish now, but I also kind of want to try one of these on the top water because I see fish jump only like twice, but I'm thinking I'm going to try this bone one. If you see something better that I should use, let me know. 
you gotta use like a loop knot or something but i'm not very good at tying those so we're gonna do our best yeah i have no idea what i'm doing well until i learn how to do one of those we'll just do a normal knot was that a fish oh man i never know if it's a fish or not but that looks like one oh maybe maybe I don't know, it doesn't feel like anything now. Oh, maybe. Oh yeah, that's a fish. No, that's a seaweed. Man, I hate sargasm weed. I should also see if my leader is way too long. Yeah, definitely. Maybe I can do a... A loop knot if I do it so big. Did I do it? Maybe. Got that little loop knot. Once again, if that's not how you tie it, tell me. If you actually know what you're doing, fishing, and you're watching this, I hope it's just to let, make fun of me. So I've never ever caught a saltwater fish on a lure. I just realized that. I've never caught a saltwater fish on a lure. I haven't fished much for them on lures. So let's we'll see if today's the day. I don't think so, but we can try. Honestly, I think if you're throwing lures, you're not actually supposed to have one of those. I really don't know what I'm doing. Oh, there's something jumped right over there. All right, maybe it's calling me. Was it a mullet? Probably. Was it a mackerel? Maybe. Will I catch it? No. My lure looks cool though. Oh, well, I think flies. Whoa. Oh, that thing flies. This is not easy with waves. Cut some grass. This has to be the worst action that this lure has ever had in the history of it being made. All right, maybe try that bullet thing. Oh, is that a fish? Nah, I don't think so. Gosh darn it. Put some new baits on here. This weed will be the bane of my existence. I don't know the difference between a wave and a fish. It also might be that I'm so bad I haven't actually seen a fish hit that in a long time, so I don't actually know what that looks like. So this little mullet guy, you know, the one that didn't melt all the way. Is that a fish? What is going on? Let's see if that works. Oh, okay. I don't think any of this is gonna work. We gotta figure out a new plan. Is that a fish? Time to set up rod number two to just chill. So to recap so far, no fish. Can't catch them on live bait. Don't even know if it's a bite from a fish. Can't catch them on lures. And this GoPro is dying. So we're gonna be down to one camera and hopefully at least one fish. Yes, finally. Of course I turned the camera off. Oh man. Something, 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 something. No! Gosh darn it. Well, I'm sure there was a fish that time, so I'm glad I'm setting up a second rod for this, but. Ah! Guys, I suck. I really wish I didn't suck. I wish I could change my name, but you know, you gotta be truthful or something. Come on, fish! So I'm gonna keep it on my little tiny rod here for my second one. It's not that small, it's a 4,000 size reel, so pretty good. But this big guy, if I catch something I can use as a bait fish, I'll send that guy out. It almost doesn't even work. But here we go. Don't think I can throw this very far though. 
Oh, that storm is rolling in. Man, that super lightweight rod definitely looks like there's always a fish there. Something biting over here. I was taking my shirt off to go for a swim and... Okay, let's see, let's see. Come on, baby. Oh. Yes! <laughs> yes! Oh, this feels like an actual fish. Oh. See, that's why you need to put four different hooks and then just sling it out there. Oh. It's probably a catfish, but it's a fish. Ugh. Got a fish, guys. I gotta learn how to stop catching only catfish on this channel. Hey, it's a fish. There we go, little guy. Let me get him back in the water. Woo! He went back towards the shore. Let's rebait and see if we can't catch another. And hopefully it's not a catfish. Oh, that's better. Ish. That'll do. So much sand. This is definitely not need to get a wash. Looks like there's something on there, but at the same time, it doesn't look like the fish on the other rod, so. Who knows? All these sandpipers here and all the way down there. And if you see down here, you can see what they're picking for. All of these little divots. Just in case I start actually catching fish, there is bait all over. Look at all those guys. It was moving weird. Guess not. Feels like a fish, but also, no. And I missed it. Just turn the camera off, we got a big hit and I missed it. Both on the camera and on the rod. That's the third time I've done that. I got a big bite right as I turned the camera off. And you guys don't even have any incentive to believe me, so I could just be lying, but I'm not. Or if there's a fish. No. All right, two are baited. Oh, that's a fish. Gosh, dang it. Did I miss it? Nope, it's on. Yeah. Nice, an even smaller catfish. Hey, fish number two. I think this mar water is just so murky that it's mostly catfish out there. It just rained, it stormed on our way in here, so. All right, those guys are venomous, so I'm gonna go get some playas. Sorry, I think they're actually poisonous, not venomous. I'm not exactly sure what the distinction is, but there we go. Right here, those spines, they'll get you. But hey, bye bye. Call a bigger friend, slash not a catfish friend, please. Two fish, that's not bad, especially for me. Even if they are catfish, I am now out of bait though, so. Luckily, I know where a couple baits are. Literally right here. Ah, here we go. And, oh no. They bamboozled me. First one. Two. Man, they're everywhere. It's like, take your pick. As long as the waves don't come. Oh, that's a big guy. Four, there we go. Oh, maybe it was two, actually. Grab a couple more. There we go. Okay. Are you safe for like 30 more minutes? Oh, is this a bite? By the way, it's gotta come in because I gotta go say goodbye to my aunt in law So, as we went to go say goodbye, we realized that the place that they are staying has a lock on both the inside and the outside of the gate. I mean, two fish, that's not bad. Catfish, but they're fish. Unfortunately, but also fortunately, I think that means that in order to actually have fun today, I mean, it was fun catching fish, but I should probably go in the water. We should keep it some more, but it's probably just gonna be catfish anyways. All right, since I just put these on, they're still pretty fresh. I'm gonna see if the sandpiper wants them. Well, that scared him a little bit. We gotta let all the new recruits go. So cool to watch them bury in the sand. Let's see if we can get a couple. Take this out. So I got Buddy here. Boom, right down. Boom. Boom. Boom, right down. So cool. 
Well, if you were expecting to see some more fish or some cooler fish, which is all the name of my channel, I'm gonna blame this on you. But it is my fault because I suck at fishing. So subscribe if you're new. I really appreciate you guys watching this video, especially if you watched all the way through and it was just me and a couple catfish. If you wanna fish with me, reach out to me in the comments down below or on my Instagram links right here. And I'd love to fish with you, especially if you're in the central Florida area. We can do a fish off, which is my last video that I did with one of my friends, Sam. And you can watch that right over here. It's a little bit of a twist on a fishing contest. I'll see you guys there.